The Missouri House approved the bill to bring St. Louis City police under state control. Changes could be on the way. Fox News' Laura Simon outside police headquarters with more. The St. Louis Metropolitan Police Department has been under city control since 2012. If this becomes law, it would return control over to a five member board. This board would be appointed by the governor and would include the city's mayor. Yesterday, a state takeover of the city police department moved one step closer to the governor's desk. Lawmakers in the Missouri House voting overwhelmingly to advance the measure to the Senate for consideration. The legislation moves to the Senate in a 113 to 40 vote. Three Democratic lawmakers from Kansas City voted present. The city gained control of the police department a decade ago through a statewide vote after years of lobbying. This morning, our partners at the Post-Dispatch report Republicans have characterized local control of St. Louis's police department as a, quote, failed experiment. The city's police union says during the time under local control, police morale at the department has tanked and crime in the city has gotten worse. If approved by the Senate and signed by Governor Mike Parson, this would represent a rebuke of Mayor Tashara Jones's leadership of the department. The mayor disapproves of the move. She tweeted yesterday in part saying state control of police does not make cities safer. Democratic representatives from the St. Louis area are split on the idea of the state taking over. So if you were underpaid, overworked, understaffed, ill-equipped for your job, which is the current situation and has been for the St. Louis City Metropolitan Police Department, I, I just think that's outrageous. Because there's absolutely no evidence that passing this bill and creating a state board will correct the problem that is presenting, which is violence in the city of St. Louis. The proposed legislation also includes a $7,000 annual pay raise for city police. Reporting outside of police headquarters downtown, I'm Laura Simon.